Today we're going to learn how to install a Gen 2 Starlink tripod adapter. You probably will receive adapter that looks like this in black, and I'm also going to show this orange one today just because it's a little bit easier to see. When you receive your adapter, it'll look like this. It'll be sized for either a quarter inch 20 screw or a 3 8 16 screw. Here I'm going to come configured for a quarter inch 20 screw, which is the most common tripod screw. This one happens to be a 3 8 so I've configured it for that. So you just take your adapter and screw it on your tripod and then just turn it till it's tight. Hopefully your tripod will have a little bit of a rubber grip or might have a quick disconnect plate that you can connect it to. The next thing you do is take your Starlink cable and you slot it into the receiver dish. And then you take your Starlink, the cable insert it, and you find the alignment rectangle on the outside, which also extends into the inside. And then you just find the same slot where you put your cable into, and you drop that down, and you're good to go. Now, I like keeping the tripod lower to the ground, so often I will put these legs out in a straighter configuration, since this tripod supports it. And then I'll also extend the legs a bit depending on how long I'm going to be using it and how much stability I need. And there you have it. You have your Starlink Gen 2 tripod adapter installed. When you're ready to remove your Starlink, you just press the button on the pole of the Starlink, pull up, and it'll come right out. So to review again, take your tripod, screw on your Starlink tripod adapter, Add the cable to your receiver dish and align the open gap with the rectangle inside and outside the adapter. Drop down, let gravity do its thing, and it'll click into place. In the case that you need to change the size of this thread, for example, in this case from 3 eighths to a quarter, take a long Phillips screwdriver and then unscrew counterclockwise until the coupling nut falls out. Then you can remove and save the screw and the washers. You can flip the coupling nut so that the right side is up, in this case quarter inch 20. And then take the other screw and washer set that came in the small plastic bag with your adapter, drop it in, and tighten it with a Phillips screwdriver. And you're good to go.